Whip it to uh, Sundays. Whip it with tonight. We got Harker Customs, Commandant, and Custom Cannon. Hey, Hello. How are y'all? Doing? How are y'all doing tonight? Oh, pretty uh, good. Besides my downer story right before the stream starts. <laughs> <laughs> well, other than that, trying to make a grown man cry. Yeah. Yeah. Anything particular everybody working on the night or just random stuff we got going on? I am sewing the strap back onto a purse currently. <laughs> uh, once okay. I finish that, I am going to work on some LEDs on my little dio thing that for my three and three quarter dark troopers. Oh, nice. Uh, I'm going to paint the necks on these NECA superman figures i am going to paint the red brighter i i worked on my uh rocket i got the uh the new body um i did, oh, nice. the, that looks I did good. the buttons on there i got the head all all finished i had to raise the neck tag up in order to put this one on and uh i got the tail uh uh with a hinge now um i use the uh, hinge that came on the figure and i just uh, connected it to the old tail and well the uh the the tail that came with the uh no, older no figure. Figure. Yeah. yeah that looks great man yeah it's pretty cool i'm gonna I think I'm going to probably go to Hobby Lobby and get some animal feet and probably do animal feet on it. Ah, uh, okay. You got to actually have an articulated comic book ra rocket raccoon. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, uh, I got a whole kid I need to finish painting up. But do some work on it, and I got my 2.0 lore I'm working on. I got him to sit aside. I just um, see the series uh, flag. I got the non F head, which, the, which is the hoist out color head, which is black, and he comes with like plastic uh, red eyes. But I went ahead and just Sanded on, masked them, and I, I put a coat of silver on them. I'm going to do them red, uh, metallic red, like with the Grimlock I did. Debating about painting the thighs black on this one. So on the toy, the thighs were black. So. I'll probably, so I'll probably end up doing that. Not tonight. That means I have to take it, take it apart. And I'll need to mask the, unlike Grimlock, the dynamo eyes are part of the head. So I'll have to like hand paint the eyes. So I want to do toy versions and uh, the cartoon versions. I am just piddling around doing uh, random stuff. Working, gotta let that dry, so I'm not gonna be working on that. I uh, might paint on the uh, spider, the superior spider that I've been working on. Mm -hmm. Or maybe, and maybe finish making my monkey suit. Uh, anybody else see the ridiculous wave rider that Todd's announced today? Yeah, from one run, from that he was copper in like one run that was like very, very small, like storyline. Using this big buff body for uh, it was Batroscus. Yeah, um, that Midnighter, uh, is like reuse of uh, 
the future state Batman with uh, the Arkham. Uh, oh God, last what? What is it? What, the one where he's in the asylum suit and the gloves have like the texture on the top of the uh, of the forearms, and he didn't bother like I don't know, like just getting rid of that. Uh, it looks and the eyes are real real low on the head it looks very strange it's very odd I, but I, I'm glad I, I, I got I got one from a professional the uh, wow why would you not do the most known version of Wave Rider because it's Todd that would that's Same thing one that for Midnighter. I mean, that's that's a character yeah. that people uh, really want. And when Apollo happens, you'd be damn sure he's going to do right. uh, that fucking Superman body. He's going to do that new. Superman body. This is How is he going to sell two if he gives you the one you want right out the gate? Well, he's and not going to sell two. And There's what, no way what people are noticing. Uh, what a lot, a lot of people know some too on that Wave Rider. That's the Black Black Adam head, uh, Dwayne Johnson. Is it? Yeah, it's what it looks like. It looks like Dwayne as Wave Dwayne Johnson as Wave Rider. See, I wasn't hmm. sure if they actually did that. Like, if it just kind of looked like him. It, it might, it might. Just, well, of course, they could have used the original digital sculpt for Dwayne too, and tweaked it for Wave Rider. Jesus, that would be. I don't put anything stupid past. Uh, uh, I mean, <laughs> it, it is Todd, so yeah. Apollo will have Superman boots. I mean, look what he did oh, on Apollo, that. Black, Apollo on that will Black definitely White be on the Superman. Bizarro body. Apollo will definitely be on the Bizarro body. I mean, look what he did with that black and white Superman. He he literally painted stripes over and the Superman boots. That's not the correct Superman to face uh, Batman Beyond. That's that's the uh, Justice uh, uh, Lord's Superman, but with gray temples, like the Batman Beyond Superman. He don't know what the fuck the characters are. Uh, he don't he don't do any research no, whatsoever. He, he don't bother to do research when he does his figures. I don't think he knows who the figures even. I don't think he knows who the characters are, man. Well, that's, well, he proved that when he made the Speeding Bullets uh, Superman. He thought it was uh, uh, Bruce Wayne. Or he wouldn't have made it such a good figure. It's true. I was sitting there like, when they showed it off, it's like, I was just kidding around like in the, in the, in the comments. Don't tell anybody that's actually kal <laughs> Don't tell Todd it's Cal L. Yeah, if he read his comments, he probably would have shit a brick. <laughs> the best Superman figure ever made is the Speeding Bullet Superman. Ever made by McFarlane. Yeah, well, uh, yeah, <clears throat> McFarlane. Definitely add that uh, qualifier to it. Yeah, because we all know the uh, Mayfix one is the best one. I mean, personally, I agree, but I mean, they're, they, you're, it's going to be, it's going <laughs> to vary person to person. I mean, my brother's going to say this is the NECA. I do like that NECA one. Is that, uh, is that before or after they fixed their uh, brittleness? Before, so it's still brittle. Uh, yeah, it can mess up for sure. 
it's not that it's brittle it's that it's uh it's the plastic is very um soft and it, it can definitely uh yeah. mar up real bad and it can uh if it if it scratches it's white underneath and it uh yeah. it, it's fucked oh what's 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 weird is uh with the, the the first wave of the uh the defenders of the earth uh figures they were white plastic painted yeah a lot of them were and then they released the, the re uh, other repaints of those figures and they got them right and they flash cordon was red plastic and so on but when they did wave two of the defenders of the earth they went back to white plastic Oh, really? Lothar, I, when I was working on it, I, I had to change a head out because the head was a racist character. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> it's terrible. Um, I use an extra a roadblock head from the Amazon to, uh, exclusive. And All right. On. Looks so much better. But when I was working on it, it's like I popped the pin out. It's, like, it's white plastic. Huh. Alpha Proto, I mentioned like in Europe, they changed uh, Dermont's name, the Slag's name. I don't know if it's universal change. They did. They made a universal change. They changed his name to Slug, which I will not call him Slug. He's Slag. Yeah. Because apparently in uh, Slag means slut in Europe, in England, I think. Hmm. I don't know about. So, so they changed his name from slag to slug which here in the u.s slag is actually well it's not even a really good term either it's, it's like when you're welding you got uh slag <laughs> like when you gotta knock off the, uh, the slag off your welds and in transformer lore it's a swear word so it became one yeah it's like slag what what do you want <laughs> No, so I worked on. Uh, I worked on putting together sectors. Uh, Superman, the parts. The head is just temporary, but we got the one thousand uh, chest piece, oh, nice. the Bizarro type um, arms, and we got the Page Punchers legs because the legs are bigger on Page Punchers. Uh, I had to do a lot of modding to get the uh, yeah. crotch to work. No modding, though, for the arms. It actually just worked out. And That's the good. chest, obviously, you don't got the little droop there. Uh, the, the torso is a little loose, so I'm going to have to get in there and do an O-ring. Uh, yeah. But, I mean, that right. is the body he should have done right there. That looks good. That is a good combo. Let me blow that up when we're... That is a good recipe. Yeah, let me kill the brightness down on this. Move this a little. So, bit. how many figures are we looking at here that had to be sacrificed for that? Three. That's uh, sixty dollars Superman, at least. Yep. Yeah. Not including the paint and whatnot. Effort. 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 Yeah. Yeah, you'd be, looking, you'd be looking at uh, three. Some of them are, you know, not as expensive. You can get the page punchers for like, I think, 17 or so loose. Uh, the arms, uh, I have no idea. You can get those pretty cheap. And they match, so that's good. And then I just have to match this blue to this, and uh, you know it's good to go. And then you know, bright and use something brighter for these, and uh, it's solid. It's it's ready. You know, I'm gonna do a cloth cape on it, uh, and it's ready to go. Like it's 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 good. We're gonna do a better head on it, of course. But uh, yeah, I'm I'm very pleased with uh the outcome on this the uh it's it's 
what I mean, I feel like taking it to a con and being be like, here you go, man. Uh, here you go, Todd. I uh, I fixed it. So here's your new recipe, dog. <laughs> Got it. Nailed it for you. Yeah, he's got the the sector, uh, sector two eight one three that Justice Lord Superman had. Looks like he had bad shellfish. It swelled up. <laughs> Oof. Oh yeah, it's bad. Yeah. So, so now now I got it, I got it all set for you. So and he's plenty tall. So yep. you won't be you know like shorter than you know like all the other uh, you know figures that come out now. So he's he's tall enough, and his arms come to the you know right length, you know, and you can see hurt. that his quads are you know nice size. Calves are really good. Plus, he don't and have it, the the armor on his legs like the other legs do. Yep, it's good. It looks great. The symbol is nice and uh, big. Yep. Doesn't have that damn droop down at the bottom. But you don't like to have them have the droop. Yeah, Sector pointed that out to me, and I was like, "Yeah." yeah they, they all, all the Bizarro body ones have that little teardrop droop. I mean, how do you just? not see that and go oh no we gotta because fix that he hates superman yeah a lazy character your spawn is a lazy character you make him like it's batman feet. it's batman and moon knight with spider-man uh face dude yeah well he's made over the years he's made spawn more and more powerful he might as well just be superman and then, and then, like he realized he got too powerful, and then you know he took all his powers away, and then he started over again. Okay. That yeah. And then away, when his when his abilities ran out, his suit exploded, and he killed the clown, the violator, and some dude from heaven. I don't know. Probably. Hey, spoiler warning. Oh. <laughs> If they haven't read it at this point, they're probably not going to. That was a while ago. Yeah, it's 40-something issues ago, so what, three years? Yeah, I, I don't know what the fuck's going on with them, and I'm not going to read it. I mean, it, it, it's, it's like... You know, I bought it, and I'm not going to read it, so... You what? I can't... I can't. I can't tolerate the the writing style. Well, it's all written by Todd, and it's all shit. It's it's really bad. I feel like uh, you, like you, a junior a junior year writer wrote it. You think yeah. after all these He's damn done. years, he would uh he would be decent at writing by now? I got nope. the front forks and the rear swing arm done on the other second bike. It's kind of like Joe Matarera with, uh, you know, the with the new Battle Chasers continuation. You would figure that he, after all these years and like helping out with uh, with all those um, stories in uh, the games that he's worked on, you'd figure that he would uh, know how to write for the shit. Nope, the new Battle Chasers apparently suck. I mean, if somebody else has read it, uh, let me know, because you know I'd like to I'd like to you know check it out. But his his art style is kind of just that's come and gone. You know, it's like it used to be like something special, but it, it's it's not special anymore. Like so many people have like surpassed that. Oh crap! I need another coat of black on this. It's gotten some silver sparkles in it from uh, paint some silver stuff. And uh -oh. it's like it's like the on 
There we go. I'm pretty sure that's exactly what he looks like. Huh. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Are you going to do the... Uh, <laughs> Do you get to do the Bram, Bram Stoker's Dracula uh, hair and do like the two, the, the butt? No, I figure I'd style him like a old Celtic monk, you know, with the tonsure where they shave the front half of their head. So just oh. make, it, make it a big fan and make it a Centauri. Big fan waved out of here. Nah, I'm working, I'm working on the mullet. It'll get there. Hell yeah. Spike the front, dude. Make it a spullet. That's spullet. <laughs> Let's do a test fit. That's here. Don, did you get number 17 of Ghost Rider yet? <laughs> no. I looked. I went to two comic book shops and sure as fucking shit, I couldn't find it, buddy. Yeah, I've been having. I've always been a bane of my existence, man. I haven't been able to find it. Yeah, I, 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 asked you, man. I asked my buddy. Uh, he, he had um, sixteen and eighteen. Believe it, have seventeen. Yep. Now that's what I saw too. Sixteen and eighteen. They had fucking everything else. They didn't have seventeen. That's weird, dude. I wonder if they just like under uh, uh, uh printed. My 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 comic book store guy, he said they did it was a, a small run on it and he don't know why, it just did it, it sold out across the board. I was like, if you can get it on like a second print or something, you know, I'm not interested in the money. I'm interested in, you know, having the store. sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Yeah. If it's a reprint or a third print, I don't really care. I even looked when I, because I put in a Midtown order, and I, I looked uh, yesterday for it, and it, they didn't have it, and I was going to grab it on Midtown, and uh, sure as fucking shit, man, they didn't have it there either. They, uh, they're going to put me in a, in a point where I'm willing to spend like $15 on it. Is that how much it is on uh, eBay? No, shit, no. You find one on eBay, it's like 25, 30 bucks. No way. And if you get one in those little clamshells, you know, the graded or whatever, then oh. it's even more. Why won't they not print it again? Why won't they do a second print on it? Why are they... That's wonderful. Mid Midtown doesn't have it uh, still. Yeah, I went to Midtown, Mile High, uh, that the Amazon of comic books. What is that? Carpool or whatever? Carpool. Car yeah, car carpool, something like that. I'll have to wash this back off. Do another coat of black. In my fucking lap. Come on. Uh, go yo comics man i have been everywhere looking for that thing well, on saturday and sunday there's not a lot going on because the installation's closed so i'm just cruising everywhere i can think to look to find it and i haven't i've not had it well look i've had luck i've i've found it here and there but man i just i ain't gonna spend 30 bucks on it i don't blame you there not yet not yet. They gotta shoot me down for at yet. least another three months before I'm willing to spend thirty bucks on it. Another book that sold out like insanely fast was uh, the new Transformers book. I got one. I got one of those. It's uh, when I walked in the store. He's like, "Hey, I got good news. You get to pick what cover you want." Uh, I was like, "God damn!" I don't care, man. Whatever you think. <laughs> yeah. Everybody sold out of it. Yeah. Brad didn't get his uh, lunar shipment this week, uh, last week. So hopefully he's got one in there with it. it you, they got to make a minimum order requirement for their ship. 
look at this. Image ships with the uh, lunar. They're towards the end. I W W's book got really bad. I don't. I don't want to blame Hasbro for sticking their skinners in their creative process, but I'm always positive that's what happened. I mean, you can't take some of the very best Transformer stories ever written. And then just over the course of like two years, it turns into some of the worst stories ever written without something going on. Oh, oh it's IDW, so that's what's going on. <laughs> they're, they're, they're incompetent. They hire the, the bottom of the barrel most of the time to, for writers. They're not oh. in to get good writers. Hasbro pulled all their license from IDW, which IDW doesn't even make sense how they even, they're still a company because they are in the, the red every year by millions. Even discount comic books doesn't have it. Holy shit. They're going to be in the red. Anybody, anybody trusting that the uh, Toys R Us is coming back? No. Oh. Um, um, they said it before. So. Independent stores, or uh, they already have uh, stores inside of Macy's. But, they're no, it's something like twenty nine stores nationwide. Yeah, that's the big news that they're talking about bringing back uh, brick and mortar stores. The new owners. Really? Because yep. uh, they're having such success in Canada? Hey. They never They've shut down. Extremely well, well in Canada. Well, technically, Canada is a completely different entity. It is not the. When it went bankrupt up here, it is a. Canada just kept on going because it's a different company. Right. But they. Um, they're still doing. Well, so I imagine that they're they have well, to be they're like, at my, that. most people I know in Canada they said Toys R Us was their last resort because they're double the price of everybody else. No shit. They're like uh, they're like the, their prices are like our FYE stores. Fucking hell. What's that? I know, like, they have, is it TV that they have? Electronics Boutique? Do what now? What do they have? They have Electronics Boutique, EB. What do they oh, have up there? They have something weird like that that we used to have. Um, game, they, they, the, the, that store is now GameStop up there. Okay. They switch they, well, they have something up there that's different than the, our, the, where they they get like pre-orders through, and they're fast as hell. The, they get it, the it's game up, Canada. Uh, it used to be what you were talking about that uh, uh, EB Games or something like that. Yeah, and they officially changed over to GameStop up in Canada. Huh. Yeah. I think I messed that up.
I cut off this pattern like almost a year ago. And I'm about to put it together, but I think I just messed that up. I mean, I certifiable. I uh, I thread lock these edges and everything on the ball. and I, we watched the Equalizer 3 today. Any good? Not really. Uh, I think it's worse than the 3. Mm -hmm. it, I'm still going to watch I had, it. I had hopes that it's going to be like, it, it is kind of feel like it's a little bit where it's returning to the roots where he's helping individuals instead of like going after this, his old team type thing. I didn't like that with about the second one. Mm -hmm. his, his old team turns out to be bad guys yeah but uh, yeah it's slow and majority of the movie in Hollywood if you're listening you can just have them speak Italian for a few words and then go speak in Italian and let them speak English and like I don't know Tom Cruise is the Valkyrie. We, we know everybody was speaking German, but they spoke English. We're fine with that. So most of the mo majority of the movie, you're reading subtitles for the Italian. But they do speak English in it some part, or parts, but... It's not a hard concept. You're not making high art movies. You're making the dude killing people. And <laughs> Payback style movies. Oh, SBA is here. He's got their first bang of the night. Family, 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 family. Oh, well, I should have used this when we was talking about Todd, one of his designs. When, anytime he makes a figure. Now comes the part where we throw our heads back and laugh. Ready? Ready! Ready. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's just the uh, potential is there, and it could be really great, but they're just really yeah. not. Well... They have good, like, comic book style bodies. He wants to use these weird. Wave Rider, a textured mesh body suit. He's like an energy being <laughs> in a containment suit. And you just did Captain Adam, and they did a pretty good job of Captain, Captain Adam. Use that body and do classic <laughs> Wave Rider. Of course, he gave Firestorm firepower like effects, where he shoots like he shoots fire. Oh, so he really don't know the characters. No, he does not know the characters. It's it's sadly obvious he don't know anything about the characters. It's like you are. Is it not? Should you not hire somebody on all like? Oh. To research these characters where you make them be part of their job like hey what does this character do he's got fire on his head so we just put give him fire, fire hand I mean two minutes on Wikipedia would answer all those questions fucking 50 fucking seconds well you know I'm accounting just in case he's a slow reader <laughs> 
you're definitely a slow turner. He thinks Superman is a hated character, but a boring character that nobody likes, so he, he's not can't say he's the sharpest stuff in the drawer. But he is making millions, so what am I what, yep. what Yep, he is, and I'm not. So, so there is that. Of course, people keep giving Super Seven money. <laughs> Don't make yeah, that's... When, when I say this, people keep start giving, uh, still give Super Seven money. As, I'm not just blaming the, me and the customers. I'm talking about that twenty some million dollar investment. Uh, these he got to buy more properties from investors. Yeah, he uh, acquired uh, G.I. Joe, uh, but only to make uh, three-inch uh, page watchers. Oh, he, uh, he's, he's got G.I. Joe already. He's got uh, the ultimate line, seven-inch figures. Oh, he's got seven-inch? Yep. And he does the, those reaction figures you see hanging up the stores. He makes those. Oh, oh shit! Yeah. So he's had GI Joe for a while. He's he's basically got access to basically all the Hasbro license now. So he does Transformers and uh, Transformers, GI Joe. Uh, what else did he get? Did he announce something else that's Hasbro property? Ah. Well, he's got Power Rangers, which has more. Yeah, let's say Power Rangers is. Yep. Yeah, that's one of the reasons that Hasbro stopped with Power Rangers, right? Oh, they're still uh, they're still making Power Rangers. The Hasbro. Oh, yeah, no, Hasbro is no, making the better. Well, no, Hasbro announced that the uh, pack that they just put out was going to be their last for uh, a while. Oh, uh, they broke ties with. Uh, uh, the company that actually makes Power Rangers in Japan. Oh, is that what it is? The they're not going to use Super Sentai anymore for Power Rangers. Oh, okay. They're going to start making their own original content. Oh, oh. Okay. Yeah, I think I thought, that I thought it had to do that first one is the Cyber that's currently airing on Netflix. I think that's the uh, first original property. And I thought it had to do with the toys. Never mind. So I guess there will be a slowdown on the toys, maybe, until they start uh, doing Gain their popularity. Own, their own shiz. I don't know. It's hard. well, the people, the, the guy they put in charge of the TV series doesn't like Power Rangers, so he doesn't. <laughs> what? Come on, that's a, like that's like a trend. But that, that's the the go to now in Hollywood. You got to make sure the people working on your property doesn't like the property they're working on. Uh, like like the dude that was writing Superman. Oh, oh, oh. which one? The one that sodomized all that fucking shit and uh, did all that um that hate bullshit, the that that white hate stuff. The crazy guy. Oh, you're not narrowing it down with DC. They, they all hate your characters. <laughs> I don't want to go too far into it because it, it deals with race. Oh, yeah. yeah okay. But, yeah, the that, that DC's got a bunch of idiots like that working for them, so it's hard to tell. But, yeah, he's, he's, he's an absolute turd. But I'll leave it at that. Yeah. Still not narrowing it down. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's bad stuff to Superman. We've talked about it before. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> when it comes to DC Comics getting running their characters and screwing over the characters, that's probably everybody who writes for DC right now. This is true. This is very true.
found the found Vipera. I did a lot of work to her. The first one that I found because it had Zorana arms. Uh, mm -hmm. the, the left arm, of course, popped right off, and it actually broke right at the um, peg. So I took her back and got a new one, and I oh, yeah. uh, I Maybe. accidentally left the mask out of it. So I'm gonna work on a Kiko. Uh, I'm gonna do the cream color and in white, and I painted up the mask, the skull mask, in black, and I did like uh, gold teeth and eyes on it. So I'll have a little, you know, an extra little ninja. And my buddy uh, is going to be sending me, he's going to be sending me uh, the blue ninja. So I'm, I'm excited for that. I got a blue ninja. Oh yeah? He's like, maybe. I could be ninja. I go on to oh, that's, ninja. That's a bad. <laughs> One of those things you wish you could erase from your brain. Don't you hear it though? It's stuck in your head though. <laughs> I want to be ninja. Right to the top, chop. <laughs> Uh, they should uh, make VR troopers. That would be cool. But that would require them to actually like care. <laughs> if they had to uh, get another license, uh, get a license down. Beetleborgs would be a good one too. Red man. Red man. If yeah, you mean uh, servo from Samurai Super Squad. Yep. Which characters are you going to uh, be making the night? I don't. Uh, uh, we've got a whole kit I'm working on, uh, Ghost Rider bikes. Uh, got this is going to be uh, Space Go. Um, I think I'm gonna trash all of this. I don't like I don't like how it fits at all. I think this was made early on when I was first started doing this stuff, so I'm a lot better now. Yeah, I'm gonna just redo it. The pants ain't too bad, but I I really juke the back of them. I'm a lot better at that shit now. Say it cry, baby. I'm better. I am better than that. Fuck better now. But could you be ninja? <laughs> I think uh Hulk smash might be in a coma. Oh yeah, <laughs> it's their oh, uh, coma. Well, it's uh, Canadian Thanksgiving this weekend, I believe. We said. Oh. And they they, they they do food on multiple days. Mixing to get this right. Canadian Thanksgiving, huh? Oh, I have to wait on this. What? What the hell? Crypto fan. This blue thread is not the answer. I need a much, much darker blue. Maybe even black. But could it be Ninja? <laughs> I gotta go get that ninja and see if this skull will fit on him. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a little bit smaller body, you know, so it may be too big. Come on, monkey man, don't you fall over on me now. crashes oh we have some shaggy hair to be time to we have some time for it to crash I'm gonna go make some coffee while this figures out what it's gonna do we're gonna grab that thing up here right there I'm with you. 
be life work. I also got Cosmo. Bought this from my friend. Oh, nice. You bought it for me? No, 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 no. I bought it from my friend. It's for me. Oh, from? Not just for it's your friend. friend. I was like, oh. Hmm. It's very good. I like it a lot. Good movement of the head. It uh, has an up and down right here. Uh, so, uh, so today <clears throat> I was today. watching the Harry Housen Clash of the Titans movie with my oh, girlfriend, yeah. who definitely exists and definitely does not live in Canada. And she said <laughs> we should uh, make custom Krakens and then sell them, and then we could be crack dealers. <laughs> crack a lacken. Get close enough, huh? Plastic crack. Yeah. Plastic crack and crack villain. Hey, man, you got, you got any more of them? Uh... Got to get more of them custom toys. Is that the front of a Ghost Rider bike? It is indeed. Wade creates here. Welcome, welcome. So, what do y'all think? Is the head too big? Is it dis disproportionate? Hold on, let me see. You got a beard? Yeah. Uh, I mean, that skeleton looks, has a beard. It looks like he's wearing a mask. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It doesn't yeah, look that. like it's his skull. Yeah, it definitely looks like he's wearing a mask. Why why does he have a beard? Because it looks cool. Same reason I have a beard. It's the same reason that you could be ninja. It's a bearded ninja. Uh, if you're going for it, uh, he's wearing a mask. I think it's fine, but if that's his head, head, uh, it's a it's a tad big. Yeah, that's where he's gonna be too big. It's much bigger than the icon bodies are tiny. Senators are being too. Too spiky, but not in the right way. What? The hair I made was too spiky, but not in the right way. Must be the last way. Okay. <laughs> Get over there. I wonder if I'll ever get my skeleton so the foosh. Mm -hmm. See, the problem is this skeleton head is even bigger. When's the foosh skeleton supposed to release? He was talking about something like they were shipping. See, that's even bigger. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them. But I like it. Yeah. 
Uh, what am I gonna do with it? Come here, you. I'll uh, I'll just do a ten run then. Mm -hmm. That that way I can do it quick. There we go. That looks right, right? Yeah, that looks right, Saz. How about that? Hold on, let me switch. give me full screen. That one works too. Yeah, you can make the armor all uh dilapidated and shit and that would look dope nah i think i'm just gonna let him stay sit on my on my desk he's, he's nice to look at but i don't want him in my display no i don't like i, I was trying a different way of doing hair to see it be quicker but i don't like it get rid of it go back to the old way of doing hair even though i hate it Even though I hate it. I mean, the hair on my, uh, my, uh, Strider is fucking perfect. So, I mean, you hate it, but it, it you're works. damn good at it. Yeah. I mean, plus the hair that you're going to do on Claire is going to be amazing. I'm not making Claire's head. I thought you said you would. No, I said absolutely not. It has hair. I'm only making bald people from now on. I'm pretty sure I said that. I think it's on the live stream. Somebody can independently verify it. not like all over the place that you would uh, should do it. It's almost like she doesn't have hair. It's more like a helmet. I mean, it is maybe, like maybe I helmet. dream this up. I'm pretty okay. sure that was the case. I think it was a fever dream, Harker. Uh, but I've it. looked everywhere for a head sculpt for, and I can't find it. So, so that, that's why uh, my character is a, a nice helmet. Yeah. <laughs> of course, of course, I asked him to do a mammoth head. And then... <laughs> that was nothing but hair. That's different though, because that one I, I could just texture paint on, and it worked. And it worked. Oh, did you print one a little bit bigger? Yeah, it's been sitting on my table for a while. Because uh, uh, I'm a delinquent who hasn't shipped anything in a hot minute. You're kind of in your inner Sawyer, I can tell. Um, are you, You're out of that um, translucent orange, right? I bought more. Oh, okay. You, um, mean, you mean the red? reddish orange or whatever it is yeah the, the yeah. modesto red no no wrong person oh the uh the goby red yeah, yeah the goby red i knew who i was talking about just not what i was talking about i knew what you meant but you didn't say it yeah that that's what it, that's what it was is there any way you can print me another uh plane I can, yeah. That way I can stand up the bike. It will stand with one. No, it, I don't have one. It, his flame effect that was... Oh, yeah, that's right. Whoops. Yours got cooked in the Texas yeah. sun. And I'll, I'll pay for priority shipping and everything, so it'll get here faster. This time of year, it shouldn't matter, because it's not like... Yeah, that's right. It's not like hot as boiling hot right out. Yeah. True. When I said it originally, it was like 114 degrees outside. Yeah, true. 
of them that looks good. Yeah, that thing got toasted. Yeah, I got a grip of stuff sitting on the table. I just need to get to it. Oh, you pranked any of my stuff? I love it. Oh, you printed all of it? No, I didn't say all of it. I said some of it. Oh, I thought you said all of it. No. Why would I do that? I don't know. <laughs> I got the headlights like a... Almost like a light gold. Headlights? Headlights. Uh, Harker, you need to like clean your ears out tonight? <laughs> Yes, I think so. He, he might one. need to check his dosage. <laughs> Who else heard headlights? Come on. I heard headlights. It was clear. It's totally headlights. Wow. Bullshit. Totally headlights. <laughs> I mean, uh, there was even like a visual context clue with it. Yeah. I you wasn't know. looking. I was trying to saw this damn acrylic rod. It was a dead giveaway. Uh, Wait, Craig says he's got uh, so many customs and dials and rotation, it's hard to super focus on just one. Tell me about it. <laughs> I feel your pain. <laughs> my, my work area is just chaotic mess right now. I was just working on Space Ghost and I set it down and start painting on the, this again. <laughs> <clears throat> Four attempts to rather. Oh, lucky man. Change my style to whip. So, after that paint dries really good, I'll hit it with. Uh, I'll clean it up again and get the fingers were dirty from sanding. Clean it up and I'll hit it with. Uh, some dull coat, and then I'll gloss over the headlights. See, yeah, I heard headlights that time. Headlights? Oh, boy. Mm. So, we get, full, get full effect right now. Yeah, it looks pretty good. I like it. Pretty good looking headlight. Can't complain about them headlights. Terrible. I guess it ain't gonna work this time. <laughs> I wait great so that gold looks good on those headlights for sure. Absolutely. I do guys suggest that for oh, to the headlights is blinged out. He knows what's good. Noro six two six, uh do you guys suggest uh have suggestions for taking vehicles apart, uh, toys apart, uh you wanna repaint classified trouble bubble? But not sure how to break the seals. I assume they're glued. Uh, I saw somebody post on oh. their groups that they did a t tutorial online on how to break them apart, break that apart. Um, I haven't tore down a treble bowl yet. I'm not probably not going to. But oh, speaking of, I'm going to grab mine. I'm not going to break it apart, but I want to, there's something I want to do to it. I meant to do tonight. You're probably going to have to um, run a, run an exacto knife down the seams. I'd imagine. I don't have mine yet. Traded somebody for one. Can be on the way for too long. Thank <laughs> you. 
Okay, we got trouble bubble. Is that all I need? I think that's all I need. Forget how much I like uh, King Kong. Yeah, I feel a lot of this is glued Pretty together. High. Bubbly, bubbly. Uh, a hair dryer might help with some of these parts too, like these front pieces on the treble bubble. These look like they're glued on. Not be able to heat it. Take like a hard, what Harker said. Take a exacto go around the seams. Take the hair dryer, heat it up. But uh, there is somewhere out there. There is where somebody did a video of tearing one down. Don't know where. Okay, so have you ever tried? I'm sorry, I was doing a little research today. Have you ever tried using baking soda and water to remove paint? No, no. I've never heard of that. Yeah, I said for acrylic on plastic, you could just use... Oh, because it's a mild abrasive. Yeah, and you can like mix it up with the water and put it in there and it'll get it out of all the nooks and crannies and stuff. Oh. Huh. Yeah, it just works like... I mean, it's essentially like you're putting toothpaste on it and brushing it. It just scrubs it off. We create so finally getting a proper ghost rider not the Johnny Blaze BS which I like Johnny but I like him better in his 90s biker look than as being a ghost rider and catch is my ghost rider the traditions waiting for cheaper Python Patrol versions to come out and I'll get that one apart good call it's like it's weird it's $10 cheaper That was more a motorcycle question because it's all the motorcycle. Oh, um, now nah, I'm gonna have to make make a ghost uh, ghost rider. I've been pondering on what to use for the to make it. Is that not a you know a chamber? Hey, is that the wrong version? Do what now? Use a chamber body, or would that be the wrong version? It's too small. It's it's the little suited oh. body. I didn't. Mm. I don't have a chamber, so I don't know how big he is. Yeah, he's pretty small. He's like on the old the suited body, like with a new jacket and arms. Oh. He too scrawny. I need to eat it my sandwich. Or you need to grow a bit too. Work what I need. I asked my wife if she wanted to get up at six, seven o'clock in the morning. So I could cook her breakfast. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. She told me no. Uh huh. I was like, "Come on, fried eggs, fried bacon, you know, bagels, maybe a little Sammy, Sammy." It's the wake up that early part that goes. Ew. Yeah. She ain't down for that waking up early stuff. She ain't gonna. I don't blame her. Waking up early is complete butt.
Wade Creek says the back looks sick. Thank you, sir. Uh, big thanks to Custom Cannon. He designed the sucker. I'm just throwing some paint on it. Yeah, thanks. It's unbelievable. Oh. Wish it didn't take so darn long to print. All them weapon racks are coming along. Uh, I got distracted by everything. Yeah, same. So I spent three. You have to drop everything and make things a lot easier. I always find that my day hasn't really started until I dropped a couple things. There's a spot on the back of the bomb that comes with the trouble bubble. It's just about big enough for these magnets I got. I just need to make it a little bit bigger. Did you find a, a, a stand to put it on? Oh, I haven't pulled with that yet. I um, picked up a uh, 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 and I'm going to put it on that stand. I'll probably just make one out of a coat hanger. Word. I'm spray paint it black. Put it on a coat hanger and then spray paint it black. You got a big bag, what? Yeah. One, two, three. Making that useful. Yep. And we'll Where are you going to put that at? Put, I'm putting the magnet there. There's a little spot here. It looks like it could have plugged in right here on the back of the jetpack. Uh huh. So I'm going to put a magnet there and a magnet there and just have it go. Okay. That's All a right. good idea. I think I'll do that to mine. I will like do that also, sir. Thank you for the idea. I'm sitting over here looking like, what's the idea? You got a trouble bubble? I think his legs are pretty much the same size all the way around. So sometimes I find that gluing magnets to stuff, the magnet has a hard time sticking. So what kind of glue do you use to glue a magnet? I use Loctite and I use my Instaset. So I'm going to put the Instaset into the area where I'm going to put the magnet. I've started using the um, uh, uh, baking uh, soda. Yeah, that's the one you really want to like make sure it don't, you're going to move nowhere. Yeah. You concrete that sucker in. I, yeah, I've started concreting them in. Sometimes they just do not want to stick. 
I, I just concrete them in now. I, I don't I don't want to deal with them uh, moving. There you go. It's in there. I put that insta set in in the hole with the glue on the magnet. It's in. Now I can just put the magnet here. We don't want the bigger one. We got some different size ones. Any points Yes. Can't catch a break tonight, bro. Huh? Can't catch a break tonight. No. I forgot to measure the the thigh, and that measurement is a lot bigger. So, no crap. That's what I see. The magnet did a did what the cannon was just saying. It didn't stick for some reason. There they are so slick sometimes that they just pull pull right away from the um, super glue. Yeah. Sometimes, yeah. Sometimes I'll sand the surface of them too. Yeah, I've done that. Question is, do I want to go a little bit stronger magnet onto the jet pack? Hmm. Believe I do. Means I need to make the hole just a tad bit bigger. Eight, four. Uh, and this one down here be seven. Half a seven. Three point five. What what's going on done? Math. 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 Yeah. Patterning, so lots of math. Damn math. Damn math. Math man. Math man. Math man. So okay. seven is three. That looks perfect. So I'm using these magnets here. They're a little bit bigger than the ones I put in the bomb, so they hold really strong. So. Mealy mouse motherfucker. A bit. So I have two trouble bubbles that I want to have not done this to, of course. All right, so next is 6.3. We all agree that that's going to be. Oh, and... Perfect. 
I'm not good at writing with my right hand. Are you, are you a lefty? Yeah, everybody in my family is except for my son. Oh, really? Oh. Yeah, me and the wife. And my nephew. So what I do too is make sure I get the put the right side into the hole. I'll take so my polarities are not mixed up. A little sharpie on the side I need to glue down. So that's his pants. Rabble, rabble, rabble. Go ahead and just rough that one up. So stick. Has anybody ever had any absence? Any what? Absinthe. No, definitely not. Uh, I think it's illegal in the United States. Well, I got a bottle of it in my wicker cabinet. <clears throat> it's not illegal with that, in the United States. With that bottle at a liquor store. But uh, Maybe it just used to be illegal in the United States. Uh, the real stuff from Germany is illegal in the United States. There is a version that is legal in the U.S. Well, anyway, so what's the what's the difference between the two? Alcohol content. Well, I don't know about that. The alcohol content in this stuff is like. Uh... It's like a 140 proof. It's 69 percent alcohol by volume. Yeah, it's higher in uh, Germany. But anyway, anyway, I uh, gave it to my mother-in-law. I was like, "Here, smell this. Tell me if you'd be willing to, to drink it." And she's like, "Oh, it's a, uh, it's a bitter." And she she smells it. And she's like, it smells like Jabba Walkie. Uh, okay. She was trying to say, Jagermeister. Jagermeister. <laughs> I picked that smell, and I was like, you know what? It does smell like Jabba Walkie. Now that you mention it, <laughs> absolutely. Little magnets are not wanting to hold. I'm gonna do the concrete method. I don't want to do that where it's going to. I'm gonna. I'm, I'll sand it and see if it'll hold that way. Don't have room enough to. Do the concrete method. Uh, what if you put? Do you have some thin styrene? I mean, it's a tiny, tiny hole. I'm putting this in. I, I know. I have one. Okay. I have some styrene that's uh, maybe about as thick as cardstock. If you put a little circle that's just slightly bigger than it over the top of it. Glue the styrene down with the magnet and the styrene stick. <sighs> Barricading in it in spot, putting it in jail, yep. putting baby in the corner. Nobody puts baby in the corner. Well, you we might have to. He wants him to stay put. Alright. 
parents are parents. If baby wants some inheritance, uh, I think she can go to the fucking corner. Parker, it's not like you to miss pop culture references. I know exactly what you're talking about, but... I don't know what you're talking about. Dirty dancing. Crazy always gets a pass. Oh, that was a movie for girls. Uh, Swayze always gets a pass. <laughs> My sister liked Dirty Dancing. I just never watched it as a kid. Okay, man. You can call me closed minded if you want to. There are no explosions or anything in that movie. Yeah. Not a single one. Yep. So. As a, when did it come out? I will agree that Roadhouse is the better movie. There's a bit of statutory uh, R word in that movie. Um, in Roadhouse? No, no. Dirty Dirty Dancing. Dancing. I would venture to say Dirty Dancing came out in 80... Swayze was what, 30 seven, when he did that movie? Or 88. Yeah, I was just a little kid. Swayze it looked like he was 30 something years old in that movie, and the girl was playing a 16 year old or 15 year old. <laughs> That's not appropriate. She, uh, she got a nose job and ruined her career. Yeah, she she just had like a regular life too afterwards and had a family. Yeah, with uh, Phil Coulson. The guy that played Colson. She's also a venture the babysitting girl. The babysitter? Yep. I remember that movie. <laughs> Dishes are done, dude. The dishes are done, man. Dishes are done. Fucking love that line. First live action tour. It's one of my favorite lines in any movie. Mmm, let's do it. My favorite line from any movie ever comes from 16 Blocks. That old Bruce Willis movie? Yeah. Yeah. Y'all wrong. That's when most deaf, he gives the gun to most deaf, and the guy's pointing the gun at Bruce Willis, and he's like, well, I guess you can't be lucky every day. And then most deaf walks up behind him, puts a gun to his head, and said, no, but you can be smart every day. That's still wrong. I've come here to chew bubble gum and kick ass. Yes. And I'm all out of bubble gum. I just watched that uh, on F movies like four or five days ago. Fucking love that shit, man. Uh, I bought the Blu ray. The monotone. I have come here to chew bubble gum and kick ass. And that came from Roddy Piper, that line did. He thought it. That he thought that up. Yep. I fucking love it, man. Halloween is the best time of year. There you go. I got my bomb on my chip pack. It falls off if you jerk it, but. It <laughs> <laughs> Must not be Loctite. Well, I mean, use magnet will lose connection because it's a tiny little magnet here. Oh, It'll wobble, wobble around and make you scared that a jump, bite, jump bomb is going to fall. Oh, and... oh, but the... I like it. Mm. I got a condition. Bad.
Okay, I, I, I sanded it down this time and the top of magnet well that's going inside and it stuck that time so, magnet magnet bubble bubble I can't believe they made this damn thing and didn't give it a flight stand. I can. Yeah, I absolutely mean. can too. Right. Sounds like par for the course. Well, that down here been a perfect spot to have a, a port. It's a panel that glues in. There's a pan they glued this panel in place here. Yeah. They just made a port for the bubble. Now I got my bomb on there. And bomb stayed in place. The missile fell off. The o ring the missiles. I'm some not people, even fucking kidding, man. Some people plug the missile behind the gun. There's a little port back here. You do that, you can't turn the gun. I'm going to O-ring the fuck out of those missiles. <laughs> Anytime I see a reason to O-ring something, I'm, a fu I'm fucking on it. Nah, I'm probably just going to make the bags bigger. Yeah, you can put a little, little dab of glue on them, let the glue dry, and that'd be fine. What? No ring Hell yeah! Or put some nail polish on. Alright, don't you fucking fall. It's <laughs> all waiting on that price for that 112 Snuggie. She'd be a bitch. Just buy, um, um just buy a, a, a Red Death. There you go, got your 112 Snuggie. Live action Thor was better in Full Metal Jacket. <laughs> was there a Thor reference in Full Metal Jacket? Oh, the, that's the actor that goes crazy. That they they pick on and he goes nuts and he kills the sergeant and kills himself. Yeah. Was that uh, Vincent D'Onofrio? Sergeant. Sergeant yeah. Piles. No more pain. God, the Dean off. So good, man. Is uh, you've had a long career. Goran was great in Criminal Intent. I don't care what anybody says, he's my favorite, easily my favorite. Everybody's like, No, oh, Briscoe, like, eh. Goran. So, I got magnets in both thighs. Or, or hips, I mean. Stabler, second. Snuggy, yep. That'd be about right.
Anybody watched Forge the Fire? I have. Uh. I don't know if it still comes on or not, but I did find out why Wheel left the show. We did oh. an interview. They fired him. Really? Uh, I don't know. They said like he was leaving for like just to be for a time with the new uh, family where they had just had a baby and stuff. He couldn't stand their asses because they're phonies. They they lost like the meet the judges competitions. And they would reshoot it and say the, the the judge won. He wanted everything to be true, to be real. And most of them were talking out their ass too. He goes, I, they don't, now every, every one of the panels, they were supposed to be have like, especially doing this different things, doing that. And longer the show went, everybody acted like they were an expert, like a weapon, like compact. Uh, situations and everything else and like dude you were uh, like making props before the movie started non-functional weapons but he even got frustrated in his dressing room he was just making doodle they, they were fine trying to find reasons to fire him it was like like what we were talking about before like when you're like in class we'd make doodles in our notebooks and stuff Right. Had, like we're him kicking their asses like in a notebook and they've gotten they basically went into his dressing uh, trailer without permission and got that notebook and used it to fire him like he's threatening them who is this uh wheel from uh, forest and fire hmm. if he wants know. to threaten them he could he's actually combat military special forces veteran <laughs> If he's going to threaten them, he would do it in, to their face. It's true. It's true. Like on a show they had, like the Beat uh, History Channel had, where uh, people were like, people just come in the wilderness and try to uh, take them down. And one of the competitors, like, he was wanting everything to be real, no lies. And one of the guys came on the show took him down. He was across the river and he got tagged or right, right, right. uh, shot come through and they wanted to reshoot it so he could win. He said, I'm not reshooting it. He won fair and square. And they would do that with the uh, competing against the judges on Forged and Fire. If the competitor is doing better than the judge, they always get the judge to win anyway. But they want to make sure the judges are unbeatable. Because what? It reduces their authority if they get beat? Yeah. Somebody has a fragile ego. Don't you yep. want your, your students to surpass? Surpass. The master. And what show is this? Forged and Fire. It's a bike smithy show. <laughs> yeah, Helms versus the third Thor. Yeah, because you had the, the Incredible Hulk. You had the the Thor from uh, 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 Adventures and Babysitting. Then you had Helmsworth. Those that he used to make custom knives, cool. I, I always found it like cool, like watching that stuff, especially people doing Damascus. But I couldn't do the heat. I used to do glass blowing. And, oh, that's uh, hot too. That is hot. Yeah. Is glass uh, first name or last? It was a material, you perv. <laughs> <laughs> they will be able to besides using screws is there any way to repair broken pegs uh, depends on where the peg's at and how strong it to me I've used uh, styrene rods 
drilled a hole through the peg and that broke off and drilled into the heart and put the firing rod in, slide it together, glue it all back up. You, uh, you can't just do the butt the butt. You need more um, area to glue it together. Oh, that moonshine show is so fake. It, it's it's video confession. <laughs> if, they were, if it was real, they'd all be in jail. King Solo family. I don't have friends. I got family. Lower legs. Yeah. Uh, I think you could probably get by. Uh, one thing too, you could do if you do like a metal pin, do like a nail, do the same thing. Go through the mushroom, put the glue using the mail, nail. I'm actually off tomorrow for Columbus Day. Me too. And so is my son, and so is my wife. It'll be the first time in a little while that we've all been off together. So I think I could... You don't want to get up and eat bread with me, though. Since I have that question, I have a masterpiece that clone is a broken arm peg that the screw also has to go through in the center of it. Ooh. Hmm. Which version you got? Do you have the uh, Transbots or the uh, Sans Toy? I'm so well I'm hearing uh, rumors Ross is getting uh, all kinds of action figures. Uh, action figures. I've seen the classified Sergeant Slaughter's is hitting Ollie's. Oh really? Wow. Yep. I, I went to Ollie's uh, yesterday and I didn't I didn't really see anything. I don't have all these. Uh, Chico for five bucks. I suck. I got a thirteen dollar uh, uh, Tiantina. <clears throat> nice. Hey Cannon, you want me to go live when I go up there tomorrow and you can just look around with me and see if there's anything you want? <laughs> no. I don't have any space for anything else. Man, Ollie's isn't good for buying stuff that you want. It's good for buying stuff that uh, you're gonna customize. <laughs> I don't have I don't have space for anything else. I just have to take apart old stuff that I already have. Well, Throw away some of them it. notes you got piling up on your desk right there and make some room. No, I threw those notes out because they were telling me that I had stuff to do. Uh, yeah. You don't need to kind of negativity in your life. Yeah, it was bringing me down, so I I ignored it and threw it away. Bringing me down. Isn't that how you do that nowadays? I'll be right back. I got Luke Cage. Well, crap. Well, fine. If you don't like them that much, if you don't have to look at it. That's what a good, solid. Uh, our return to. Being your fucking two shorts. Age Christ. Our nice return to uh, window boxes. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do some work to that thing to get it to where I want it. No, I saw somebody had a cool idea. He's replacing the torso with a classified uh, roadblock. No, currently I got like uh, classified some, roadblock, huh? Some B wings on my table and a mammoth head and. Uh, 
radioactive man head or something. Some. Ugh. Ghost Rider bike parts. <laughs> man, that's lazy not painting around the arm yellow. Yeah, I'm going to put some uh, cloth around there. Because I'm not, I'm not gonna paint yellow. Not really um, digging the head sculpt either. Huh? Not really digging the head sculpt either. Oh, I like the head sculpt. I saw I somebody put that the, afro. That afro. Well, I saw somebody put the toy biz head on it. It looked even better. I'm, I am so into that afro. Uh, it is fantastic. There's no, there's no boot swivel. On yeah. It's afro. There's no boot swivel. I'm gonna have to take those bitches off and put boot swivel on it. How do you how do you make boots with big ass flares and not put a swivel in it? Because fucking Hasbro, that's how. Because there's you take this off, there's gonna be a square peg those are glued into. Yep. I'm Does gonna Afro have to take swivel? that bitch off and put screws in there. Does the Afro have a swivel? I don't know. It should. It'd be fucking sweet if it did. It looks like a Luke Cage in his twenties. No, 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 no. That's my man. What? Mine will be on the way in a few days. Uh, I gotta wait on my pile of loot to uh, finish processing. It's like, uh, it, well, to give you an idea. Uh, it cost eighty dollars to get my pile of loot moving. <laughs> so That's it's a got a few things in it. So it's four dollar shipping. Four dollar shipping, but the tax on uh, everything got you. was the eighty bucks. So yeah, it's got a few things. That's a lot of stuff you got there, Harker. If that's just yeah. the tag. Jesus. It's a it's a couple things. I've been kind of uh naughty waiting I haven't you know they, they've been in there for a long time I, I've had uh, one of them well, they only, they they hold, only hold it for 90 days I've had one of them that had uh, 11 days left on it so it was like okay I need I need to, I need to get this shit at least he's got a disc hinge oh for the neck yeah he's got, he's got a dick hinge yeah I Fucking hate those double ball pegs. The ball peg is great if you have a separate neck piece, and the ball peg is in the bottom of the neck. But the top should be a disc hinge. They did away with that with the GI Joes. They're going to double ball peg at the bottom, double ball peg at the top, and you're losing sh shit tons of range in that head. See, I thought, I thought for sure that um the reason that we saw the uh the black skin uh through the uh the damn vest under there is because he had butterfly nope and nope that is some bullshit so I i'm gonna put i'm just gonna take the the vest off and uh Put some cloth there. Is it a um, heat and pop, or is it a crack situation? Uh, I'm trying to see. The mushroom pegs are so soft on the arms. I did. I about yanked the bicep right off. I'm thinking the arms might pull out. I see sockets that look similar to like a like a build a figure. That would be the best situation possible. Well, I'm yanking on them and they're not budging. I saw somebody have one 
already have taken apart using he's doing the roadblock torso or swap so uh, well that has a that has a sculpted uh 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 that has a sculpted um uh shirt on it doesn't it oh the shirt's a separate piece on the roadblock oh the roadblock roadblock yeah. has uh no it's it's uh the amazon one has a sculpted shirt the regular red version does not regular version doesn't the first version it's got a vest oh. on you can take it off <laughs> oh, let me see if i got one huh. And that thing has butterfly joints too. Yep. Well, the gung ho is the same body as the first version of uh, Roblox. The same body. Huh. Here's one. This is what the we take the vest off of Roblox. Uh, what you got? Huh. You got butterflies, very restricted butterflies, but you could, with the shirt on there, you could actually cut into this too. Open these up. Now for a little more movement. That is nearly the same size. Maybe even a little bigger. But if you got the roadblock, you'll have your separate neck piece, butterfly joints. left i use them all for customs but you can get that for version one pretty cheap It's him not all at once. Okay, nobody in there. I uh sorry, I'm I'm having to use my brain and I can't chew bubble gum and walk, you know what I'm saying? Oh. There we yeah. go. There's all the eyes lit up. Does that just go through the head, or how does that work? Yeah, hold on. Let me uh, adjust the focus. The Whoops. these have um, ah, shit. It's just clear in the back. There, uh, it's red in the back, so the eyes are. I mean, translucent um, red. Yeah. So you just light it up through the back of the head. Oh, uh, Doros, we want to talk about like the. Uh, oh, that's cool. Uh, the trouble we'll take apart is on a Facebook group. 
And so what I've what I've done here is I've put a acrylic rod through each one of these uh, little <laughs> chambers. This each one of these little chambers has an acrylic rod that runs through it. And then there's a big rod that when I put an LED on each side, it lights up the LED, it lights up the rods that are connected inside this tube and those feed through and light up the, see, it lights up the in, interior tube, which lights up the back of the, so you can see where the pass through is on the uh, figure. And then it lights up the eyes. My only question is, is how big a rod are you jamming in there? Big. Look what you say. Big. big. An acrylic rod, you know, they're hard to come by, huh, B? Big. Acrylic rods aren't hard to come by. I disagree with you, sir. Well, I don't know where you're getting your acrylic rod from, but they're hard to come by. There's, there's a place uh, 45 minutes away from here. You can go get all the kinds oh, of yeah. rods yeah, and that's cheap. like $30 worth of gas. Ever one. What kind of car are you driving? <laughs> $30 worth of gas. We'll leave those on now, for a while. They giving that shit away at $7 a gallon, you know what I'm saying? I mean, yeah, Ooh. it's expensive. That's expensive. It ain't that expensive here. I don't think it's that expensive there. It's like four dollars a gallon or something. I worry that you know like everything about where I live. No, I can't get the what are you arm. talking about? Your post office is open right now. My post Jesus. office isn't open. It's, it's 55 degrees with a zero percent chance of participation. The, the average gas price today in the U.S. is 377. How much Ooh, is it? I'm over. We're over. We're at, right at. We're like 395. What about in California? Everybody knows that California is not part of the United States. I like Texas. No, Texas imports uh, the oil and gas is made here, so it's always cheaper here. If you're the closer to you are to a refinery, the cheaper it is. Um, California gas average is for regular it is five eighty, and for mid grade it's six oh six. And it's close to what Don. And how much is it here in Texas? You can go out the door and find out. <laughs> Go look at it. It's uh, premium is four dollars and regular is three thirty eight. Higher than I thought. You know what's free? Bicycles. Anything you steal. Walking. <laughs> Christopher. If you gotta buy shoes to do that. No, I'm pretty sure he's expensive. No, you can walk barefoot. Ain't you going to tear up your feet if you do that? No. no Ain't you going to have to like enough. go to a hospital and get your feet repaired? Nah. But you can't go to like the real hospital. You have to go to like a, a foot doctor. Come on, you pansy. I was in the army, man. I know what it's like. You can walk around barefoot. <laughs> you can, but not forever. 
Oh yeah, I did when I was a kid. I walked around on hot asphalt in the middle of the summer when it was 106 degrees outside. You walk around barefoot long enough, your feet get tough. Yeah, but survival training states that you have to have some kind of foot covering. Well, I mean, that's because you're going into places where they got nasty parasites that crawl in through your feet and <laughs> lay eggs in your liver. Eat all your food, tapeworms. Yeah, not around here, though. Also, if you stay out of the mud puddles, you got less chance of that. Uh, what now? This dude's got some long arms. Let me let me tell you. What's it? Something about tender feet. I missed something. Here's a tenderfoot. What? Don. Don's a tenderfoot. Yeah. Says you can't walk around barefoot. You can't. Not forever. Yeah, you can. Actually, there's a. Uh, your feet get real tough. You don't wear feet for shoes. There's a. Was it tribe? I don't know, like it's this documentary thing. These people went to like this tribe of people who wander the, the woods and the jungles and stuff. Their feet actually look more like uh, eight feet. They've been doing so long. They were laughing at like the documentary people because they couldn't keep up. It's a hefty leg for the minus one. That probably weighs as more than the, the Luke Cage figure. Yeah, I got a ah. left or right arm, whichever one comes with the red ninja if somebody wants it, because I'm not getting that. Oh, I wave. do. I definitely do. Absolutely, I'm putting that thing together. I definitely would like to build one too. Yeah, Don, I'm putting that guy together. Don, do you get one of those arms? Well, well I got the uh, Obama leg. Didn't you get the Red Ninja? No, no, no I got Iron Man. I thought you were yeah, going to get the... I, got, I thought you would get the Red Ninja because of the skull head it comes with. Yeah, I, I know, but it's just basically the Ghost Rider one. If you don't... I don't know. I, I was feeling really indifferent about it. If you are not planning on building it, uh, can I get that leg from you? Yeah, absolutely. Because I don't need the Iron Man. I don't think anybody needs that Iron Man. It's pretty terrible. I want you to take a moment. Look at the articulation on this guy. Particularly right there on his arm. Right, where it dips down. That's a hideous chunk that they've cut out of there to put his arm in like that. With the knees too. Pretty, pretty serious. Knees don't bother yeah. me as much. I mean, they're weird. But that underarm. Well, the fact that let me see the, the front of the knee is it's pretty beefy. Like, uh, yeah, beefy. the front of that's pretty bad. Look at that. Look at that gap. Yeah. Yeah, that gap is pretty serious. Got some weird stuff going on with this figure. What figure is it? Yeah, look at that chunk that's out of that underarm there. So he can hold his arms down straight. Sitter 213 at dawn reminds me when McLean had no shoes for on Christmas. Broken glass made it the best Christmas ever. <laughs> See, if he walked around barefoot all the time, that glass wouldn't have been a problem. I'm thinking it still would have been a problem. No, it wouldn't have been. 
Wake up, Alice. Well, especially him being a tender foot there, because that's not even real glass to get out of the foot. Yeah, I know. It was movie glass. What a, what a bitch. Okay, let me look at... All right, give me something. Give me... Well, some of us still have to go to work tomorrow. What? Hmm. Huh? There's people there. As uh, I understand it, it's a federal holiday. I got paid extra money today. Well, the... Well, uh... At my job, I'm oh, off. Break that holiday. Staff is off, but uh, other employees have to go to work. The other employees? Employees. The other type of employees. Where I'm staff, I'm uh, considered a state employee. We get more holidays off. Yeah, all the federal ones, right? Yeah. I think we're up to eight a year now. Eight federal holidays? Yeah, I think so. Mm. Hmm. I'm off whenever I say I'm off, which is never. You should bring it up with your boss. Yeah, you need to complain, man. Burnout's a, a thing. My wife? She's going to say, don't you need to pay for a bunch of action figures? And I'm going to go, Dang. I, I, I have I have Xavier and, and I have Sector. They help, and they'll and she'll say they don't pay for all of them. And, and I'll have to say, okay. But I did sell all my Black Series to my friend, so I have fifteen hundred uh, in credit. <laughs> with him at his store. So hopefully he'll, he'll get in a bunch of stuff that I that I want. And I don't right. have to uh, buy too much shit. See, doing this hair takes forever. I like a good hour and a half on that. That's alright. It'll look good when I'm done. But I'm going to call it a night, night guys. Alright. Have a good night, my friend. Hey, hey, hey. Remember, wear them shoes, bro. Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> lace them up tight. Don't, Don't trip on the laces. Not happening. It's going to be me, barefoot in the jungle, running around like a maniac. Running That's around kind of like brain-eating parasite. Go all crazy and stuff. Who runs around his underwear? Freakazoid. Freakazoid. Power of the internet in the palm of the thing. Yeah. All right. Good night, fellas. Yeah. Thank, thanks for having me on again. Oh, well, always a pleasure. Glad you come, come out and hang out with us. Shenanigans. 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 Hmm. I don't want to do this. I think that's too thick. Want dinner? Yeah, that's that's the that's the ticket right there. My hands just stopped shaking. I wanted to paint these Superman necks. I'm too tired for that shit, man. Huh? I'm too tired. I want some stuff like that. Neuropathy's a bitch. I wanted to paint that and I wanted to paint 
on the this rocket. Yeah, they're still a little too shaky. It's grunt, it's great, man. I almost passed this guy up, but twelve bucks, man. I I, I definitely couldn't. Pass Dude, that's this guy awesome, up. right? They never even showed up at my target. They put them out too early, and my friend ended up finding uh, a few of them. And then he's like, oh shit, they're 12 bucks. So he ran around and got like 30 of them. He went to wow. every target and he asked for them and they pulled them out of the back. And uh, they just sold every single one of them. He went and got like 30. What a man. What a guy. Yeah, right. But he did get them for all of his friends. So, I mean, it's not like he scalped them. So. Yeah, but I ain't his friend, and if I live in his area, he don't fuck me. <laughs> well, you don't live here. I'm so. not in his little bitty, teeny, tiny clique of friends. That means I don't get what was he buying? Grunt. Yeah, that means I don't get a grunt. <laughs> no, it means you don't get a grunt. Boo. Definitely getting some Halo vibes off of this helmet. Yeah, that's what I thought when I saw the helmet. I like this one more than uh, than this one. This one's the classic, though. You always uh, you find find one of those cheap stalkers. You can actually gear him up with one of those helmets, like a full face helmet. Oh yeah. They're supposed to be hitting Rosses and uh you have Ross out there? Yo yeah. That's true. That might be dope. Could do the some of these parts on here in the darker green. Mm-hmm. That'd be kinda cool. That'd be nifty. Problem is, finding Ross that actually has anything good. Most of Man, them. Man, all my Rosses always have full on garbage. Yeah, most of them look like they just got looted. And that's that is definitely true. And that was the crap that was left over and that even the looters didn't want. <laughs> that is also definitely true. It's about what my Ollie looks like all the time. Open up this TN Teener. Open a bunch of crap up since I uh, can't actually paint any damn thing. I know where mine. I hate making sleeves. Can never get the curve right. Making what? Sleeves. Oh. Never get that curve just right. I finally decided to uh, swap out the Joan Rivers head on uh, Cover Girl. I'm giving up. What um, what head do you think? I would assume uh, one of the Black Widow heads. I don't even know what these things are called. What are these called, Parker? Yeah, I could go with the smiling head and 
because she she's she's definitely not a an angry person. So that'll give me a. I could just put the hair from Cover Girl on that. The French tickler, right? Well, Cover Girl girl's drawn with uh, long hair too sometimes. So. Huh? She's also drawn with long hair too, so you can actually do. Nah, I don't want to do the long hair. Anytime I can get short hair on a, a female figure, I'm, I'm down with it because I like short hair. It took me, uh, it, it took me, you know, 17 years to get my wife to cut her hair short. Right now it's grown out, but uh, and she'll cut it eventually. Man, I don't know. I'm just going to have this top piece of styrene go straight across. I'm not going to follow the contour of the crease between the pecs. Because I want to flatten that out for when I put the sculpt in. for track for one of the day. The what now? <laughs> the protractor won the day. There we go. Jared, do you want a glider without a stand? No, thank you. It's real jazzy. I got the glider on a stand sitting over here. <laughs> I'm not even. Oh, I can it. actually, I can actually use this part for the um, the thing. Never mind. <laughs> now I want it now. I want you. You already no take yeah. backies. <laughs> no take backies. <laughs> There you go. Can't already see the white on white, but. Oh, he's nice. Did Pookie over here already uh, make you a cape? Oh. I don't have a cape yet. My screen went black. I think uh, my, my phone was about to die. I forgot to plug her up. Space Ghost, I'm working on. 3%. 3% better. Yeah. Nope. What I get for not paying attention. I guess he he doesn't have as full of a uh, docket as I do. So. No, I have nothing on my table. Who are we talking about? Space, Space Ghost. Ghost. Tape. Yep. My table is completely empty at this moment. I was just back to asking Derek the other day if he had anything he needed done. And he's like, "Oh, my little Luigi." So you never, you never come up with anything. Yeah, um, it looks like <clears throat> you're, you're gonna need a space ghost cape. Look, tell me what you like. I'll make you one. Capes uh, are easy. Sector two eight one three at Collector Express looted. That's exactly how I would describe Ross. <laughs> That's on a good day. <laughs> yeah. 
and their shoe section looks like it's uh, like a bomb went off. They have some of the weirdest likeness shoes too. Let's see what I got here for yellow. Oh. Hey, cool. the, the raw store near me was looted for sure. <laughs> Just wish the uh, they made the Luke Cage is at least as big as Hercules. He's smaller. How much smaller? Quite a bit smaller. He looks like he's a teenage version of Luke Cage. Well, he's, sm dope. he's smaller than the original Luke Cage figure. Oh, that sucks. Well, I got this... Uh... Oh, excellent. It has the fork knife thing on here still sweet I have to take that out like that, that real golden yellow there fork knife and I have this like uh, this other yellow that's like splotchy it's not stained up it's uh, I'm it's calling a, it that way that, that other one I think will work best for Space Ghost he's not really Blotchy character. But it looks cool though. I really love this hair. I popped that head on. I did it. You can actually swap out the, the neck pegs with uh, the AOA Kitty Pride. Hmm. You can put a Marvel Legends head on that body. Nice. These hands are fucking serious. They're man hands. She can, uh, she can definitely handle up. They're the same size as Marvel Legends male hands. Jesus. Like, some Valverse female hands go a lot a long way with her. Which, uh, may be on the, uh, docket. Because... I, I don't know where the fuck I'll put her, but uh, it'll be somewhere. I did a head swap and a hand swap, and I made her uh, basically hang out with Zorana. Yeah, that's... Ooh, yeah, she could be the uh, third uh, person in my um, um, most apocalyptic murder machines crew. I may not have enough of that. How big a cape you looking for? Well, Space uh, Ghost is it is it gigantic and it has like a uh, a weird kind of bottom to it. It's like uh uh it, it does this kind of number. Actually, oh well, shit! I put them up now. Damn it! Uh, it does a this kind of number. I'm I'm cool for space yeah the regular cape, but the. Uh... Yeah, I know that. Why a regular cape? Do something fancy, bro. Do something different. Well, the big thing is the collar piece. I mean, it uh, needs to be where it can pull around and uh, lay on. Your... Right. Well, yeah, I mean, it, 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 it'll do that for sure. But, like, you know, do something cool. What do you, something different. I haven't been paying attention. What do you, what do you got? Space Ghost. Yeah, I know what's the base body. Oh, it's like the um, Spider-Man UK body. Oh. Yeah, I got a, I got quite a few of those. I think I got one set right here. It's zero from it multi-pack, and I stripped all the paint off of it. Cantina Dynamite. What about? Uh, you got no ass. Oh, I'm the Spider-Man. Yep. Uh, an old cosmic spider in the bigger body. 
I'm burdened with no acetol, and uh, I got more ass than she does. But it, uh, but it'll probably work for uh, a cake dummy, though. Good lord. What about the Spider-Man, the Game Reverse Spider-Man, the old one? I think that, that well, your Cosmic Spider-Man will probably work fine. Look at, his, look at this head that I, I made because I hated the Spider Woman head so much. Oh, yeah. It's a little crunchy on the paint, and I'm be sanding this down. But it's uh, a Jessica Jones. Well, okay, yeah. So you said that I recognize the air. Yeah, so I. I just full on sculpted this bitch, like, and I'm gonna sand it down so I can, uh, I can put it on this body. I just gotta. I did the whole magnet thing with the screw because the, uh, yeah, uh, the Spider Woman body that I had was um, fucked up. What, what kind of cape are you? We looking for? Uh, just basic cape this with a uh, probably like I like to sketch it out because it's it when it lays over top of shoulders it needs to be like a like the top would need to be like cut around the neck uh, and lay on to the top of the shoulders through here do you want it to lay in the front too it needs to be thin through here. So it'd be a one cape. I'm not going to use magnets. So I'll actually have to attach the figure. Just the way the cape lays. Oh, I can lay a base coat down. I kind of like cut like a a, a hole because he has like a little plastic cap, right? Like a little no uh, overlay that goes over the top. It's red. That doesn't need no. It's on? just yellow over top the. Over top the, uh, you know, kind of like the Eradicator. You know how the Eradicator's cape is, where it comes off the, like the Superman shield, the uh, Kryptonian shield. Oh yeah, it's kind of like that, uh, but it's thinner on the sides. Space Ghost has the same little, little, like triangle thing on the chest, and the cape comes off that. I think it needs to be one ply or two ply. I mean, the top of it's going to have to be a one ply, but you want the rest of the cape too? Uh, it'd be. Hmm. I mean, two ply, like two interior layers? <laughs> That's yeah. crazy. So, fold it inside out, so on again. Or you, do it. you don't want that shit that thick. It's crazy. <laughs> don't. No, 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 no. You just spent an hour in the bathroom downstairs and time out. <laughs> That's fucking wild, bro. I think um, probably get by with one ply on him. Well, uh, the, the cape, what's the cape, uh, the, well, the cape, the, the fabric look like on the back side. Is it, is it solid yeah. color all the way through or the lighter color on one side or the, or the other? Do you want it to be like a, a penis? Like a flowy, biggy, kind of bigger cape or? Just do like a A frame. Um. Hmm. Do the rounded bottom. Do it. Yeah, I don't want the round. <laughs> the rounded bottom. I don't want a rounded bottom. Do it. No. Don't, don't be scared. No. Don't be scared. You're scared. I don't I ain't scared, I just don't want it. You know, with one layer I could 
we could terminate the wires on the outside of the camp and you can uh uh drill them you know like poke them into your, your body and then the cape would be laying over the top where it was going into the body oh yeah that would be that would be good to uh, have it uh anchored kind of like I, how i did with Thor. highly recommend remember that Thor? yes yes Looks good. I'll look up some pictures of it. I've made two Space Ghost capes. You made one for Ken, didn't you? Yeah. And a one for this other guy. I can't remember. But I wound up making two yellow capes. So I'll look it up. And, you know, we'll we'll discuss the finer details of what I have a basic shape. Please don't jump on me. Please don't jump. Thank you. Well, I'm surprised your phone's still going. <laughs> I plugged well, it in. I have a, it oh, okay. You yeah. It. yeah, I have a thing. I have a charger right here. It, it's doing this just destroys it. I usually yeah. have it plugged in the whole time. I forgot. A lot of bandwidth. Internet kills the phone. It's using the, the speaker, the microphone, the screen. Yeah. Almost, almost every function. A lot of broadband too, because uh, doing the live streams. <laughs> there. Are you happy? Give me that. No, you gonna get down? All right, get down. All right, I think I got the chest piece ready for. They can see it. You try not to knock anything over, please. Okay. Let's see. A little bit more in between the, the clavicle, but a little dip between the clavicles. I'm getting rid of that. Cool. Might, might end up thickening the neck around the neck area too. Yeah. Not right now. He's got like a unique style. You're gonna fall off. Sorry. Mm -mm. I don't want that. Did I show you all the final result of uh, Sector's Doom? No. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I still ain't mailed off that other. <laughs> well, there you go. You wanna blow that guy up right there? Ooh, I like that green. That's sweet. You got his chalice. Man, that focus just sucks. Oh, my camera's being kind of shitty today. Quality is kind of boo boo. My phone always tells me I need to clean the lens. That's probably the case with me, too. Don't get on the fabric. He's got the big D right there. Yeah, he does. Don't mean Dallas. There we go. That's how Doom should look right there. Not that... That other crap. Fifteen.
yeah, sector, I need to, you know, send it to you. <laughs> Been done for like two weeks. Got my bro. I'm too tired to stop her. The brush I use to deal with cat hair, she's currently chewing on it because I think she knows. Hey, 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 hey. Don't leave with <laughs> she stole it from me. She's a hood kitty. Uh, you say, you, hey, you are constantly saying she's a good kitty. I am. She's a terrible kitty. Uh, Sector, her name is, her name is mayhem for a reason. Sector, did you um pick up the uh select um Mr. Fantastic? I got the select Iron Man. You got the select I have the select Titanium Man. The, I pre ordered the, the Crimson Iron Diamond. Man. You got the Iron Man everything. Not everything. What, what are you missing? Well, I don't have any of the old Toy Biz stuff. I got rid of it all. Really? Yeah. And I don't have any select Iron Man's except for the that new one right there. Space Ghost! It's not my scale. Select usually don't do good jobs on Iron Man. This is the first one that I've gotten. And I don't, like I said, it's not going to go in the display anywhere. It's not what I want. Well, I got to make him, like, he needs a belt, too. However, it does have a neck piece, so there's that. Um, he has the ultimate nullifier, does he not? Mr. The, the Walgreens, Mr. Fantastic did. Oh, I was asking about the select. I had that at one point in time. I can't remember if I still got it or not. The, the new one? The ultimate nullifier? No. Oh. I, I used a couple of Mr. Fantastics for a uh, for custom gobbies. I may still have it. But I have like yeah. six drawers of accessories. Yeah, it looks better. I'm making the, the neck thicker. It matches with Space Ghost a little better. I keep asking people uh, if they need accessories for anything. When you, uh, Sector, when you get the uh, hands in for uh, the hands in for Doom, uh, send me the uh, the right hand and send me the um, the right hand of Doom, the That's ultimate right. nullifier. And um, like not immediately, just when you're when, just when you send me something else, send me his right hand and send me the ultimate nullifier. Uh, and I'm going to adjust that hand to where it can hold the uh, ultimate nullifier. You know, that's the only comic book that's ever made me laugh out loud. What's that? The BRP, the Hellboy comic. BRPD. RIPD. Yeah, did you ever, you ever read any of those? I never read that one. Well, he has this one, and he, you know, he's got bad luck. He's got really, really bad luck. I watched both movies, unfortunately. He, uh, so. You didn't like the movies? I liked the first one. The second one, not so much. Yeah, the first one. There was three. Four, well, if you count the remake. 
the remake was not great, but I loved seeing David Harbour as uh, Hellboy. Hellboy, oh yeah, I did too. Because I, David Harbour is my spirit what animal. What are you talking about? I, I, th- I thought we were talking about R.I.P.D. with Ryan, Ryan Reynolds. Oh, no, no, no. No, Hellboy. Oh, okay. I couldn't have... Uh... I thought you were saying R.I.P.D. It was like... Uh, not... B.R.P.D. The uh, Bureau of Research... Paranormal Research and... Okay, never watched that. Uh, never read those comics either. So, Hellboy's got bad luck. That's like his, his thing. And uh, he will never... He says he never uses jetpacks because of his bad luck. And they tell they tell him they're foolproof now, and that it's no problem whatsoever, and that he should trust them. And they got a perfectly good jetpack for him. Well, he has to infiltrate this castle in Scotland or whatever, and then he he so he can't parachute down. He's got to use the jetpack. So the episode the the issue ends. He jumps out of the plane and he clicks the button to start the jetpack and it doesn't do anything. Oof. So that's how the issue ends is he's clicking the button, click, 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 and it's just not doing anything. <laughs> so that, I thought that was funny. You know, it, it, that wasn't the laugh out loud point. But I thought it was cute. But on the very first episode, the very first page of the next issue, he finally gets it to ignite, but when it ignites, it explodes. <laughs> so his stealth infiltration is him being a fireball falling in through the roof of the castle. <laughs> oh, boy. That looks so much Boy's got some bad luck. I got one side of the neck gun, the other side I'll, I'll wait to do after all this sets up. Started on the other side, but... Uh, I'll finish filling out. Well, his cow is always drawn. It's like his head and neck are just one piece. But, well, it can, you know, there's no curvature of the skull, the head. So, make us thicken up his neck, make it look more like Space Ghosty. Did you know that Iron Man became a god? Who's Iron Man? <laughs> He's a C tier character. Oh, well, you haven't heard of him. Oh. I, I read a bunch of Iron Man comic books today. It's like catching up with an old friend, you know? Hmm. Do they use him anymore? Yeah, he's still got it ongoing. Oh, no shit. It's spectacular the way it is. Some would say invincible. Uh, that's that book about that uh, girl that stole the three printer from uh, school and uh, made her own uh, mech suit, right? Oh, well, that's old. That's old. That's old. Yeah, that's yeah, old. Yeah, that's yeah, many yeah. years ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ironheart. Yeah, that, I know her. Yeah, that's an, she's important. No, no, no. It's this Iron Iron Man book. That's what it was published. She, she was. She was Iron Man for a little while. She absolutely was. She was the center character in the Iron Man book. They didn't change the title of the book or anything. But eventually she went out on her own and she has her own book now, Iron Heart. I don't know why she calls herself that. Because she ain't got no heart. She's an idiot. Yeah. She lost a bunch of friends and family and like gang violence and she said her heart is hardened and it's of iron now. Some shit, I don't know. Something like that. Okay. I, yeah, I don't, I didn't really follow her. Her back when she left the book, that was, that's pretty much it for her. Her back story was so stupid. She went to let like, her school teacher told her to oppress her so she could uh, and treat her race, be racist toward her so she can uh, uh, strive to do, overcome. Thing. All right. 
get the hell out of my class when I went to <laughs> that young ain't right. So Iron Man became a god, right? Okay. How do you do that? First, he's trying to make the world, the uh, existence, a better place. Uh huh. So he gave everybody his intellect level. You know, made everybody in New York as smart as he is. Reed Richards was there, and Stu's like. Is this how it's like for you? He's like, well, I actually, I feel dumber now. <laughs> hmm. That could be cool. They contracted Dr. Doom to, like, strip his power away from him. And he concocted, he, he put together a, a protection spell to keep you know, his influence from the people trying to strip his power from him. Yeah. And, uh, when the Iron Man finally arrived, he was like, your parlor tricks. And Doom was like, well, if all it takes is some parlor tricks to, to best you as a god, then, you know, that says more about you than me. I don't know. I don't think Doom was portrayed correctly because he told like three jokes in those books. Doom telling jokes? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'll... Two of them were funny. Patsy uh, Wildcat was the leader of this little entourage, right? And he, he gets so aggravated with him that she starts yelling at him. And Doom is across the street on top of a building, and he looks at Silver Surfer, and he's like, "This is going bad. I can hear her all the way up here." Oh, you may watch the Loki season premiere. Yeah, all right. I we still trying to get through Ahsoka. I love it. Should have been two episodes. The first episode was basically him getting fixed and getting everybody else caught up on what's going on. I love the first season. I don't. I don't yeah. A lot of people talk bad about it that I speak to about it, but man, it's Dude, like everybody's it's probably my favorite about, of all the. Talk bad about fucking everything. No one's gonna be talking sure. with. With, with Disney, anything Disney, period. Like, you can just go ahead and just say that everybody's going to be fucking pissed about everything. Well, I can tell you that Ahsoka is fucking rad. It ends awesome. It, 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 it's super good. Uh, but so many, like, Star Wars purists were just fucking, they, they hated it. Because they hate everything. They just hate everything. No matter what it is, they just can't stand it. So I'm just looking to sit on the couch and enjoy an hour with my wife, and it does that for us. So, Hell yeah, that's exactly what it is for me. I fucking love it. Good. Uh, Good. Sabine Good. is fucking Good. rad. I got, I got her figure right here. I, 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 don't, I, don't need, I don't need some great grand storytelling and earth shaking this that one the other just tell me a story and uh her face is horrible like the, the head sculpt is terrible i can't wait for someone to make a new one you know as soon as they do i'm gonna swap it out you know the, the, this figure needs a lot of help but you know I, i'm here to give it <laughs> i'm definitely going to, to to help this figure out quite a bit uh, I did. I did buy. I did buy a poncho from Josh. I I realized that I had never bought anything from him, so I went ahead and bought a poncho from him. I buy. I try to buy from everybody. Do you own any of my stuff other than the uh, um? Doom. 
Oh yeah, you 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 have the Doom. That's right. Yeah. You have two of my full costumes then. That's that's pretty cool. That is damn cool. You have two of them. I feel bad about contracting you for stuff because uh you know you're awful busy with like making money. I'm really clearing up quite a bit right now. Like uh, I'm able to tinker with uh, friends stuff right now. I'm clearing up a lot of stuff. I'm able to work on sector stuff. I'm able to work on uh, my brother's stuff. Uh, and I'm about to start a run of Moon Knight Capes, which has been a huge deal. Like people have been like uh up in my not in my descending colon not even in my transverse but my ascending colon wanting to uh get these moon knight capes and i have very little uh of the material left and to be honest with you it's not even completely uh i mean it's like almost a tiny shade off which i mean there's nothing i can fucking do about that like it, it is what it is it is like a tiny shade off from this this stuff was apparently a fluke this was an error but people are just gonna have to fucking deal with it i mean it, it might be a tiny shade off but you know that's the way it is if they want it that that's the way it goes i can't die this to make it right but i mean this is what i have left and i'm gonna make them if they if, i'm gonna make 10 if anybody complains i'm just going to not make any more or i'm gonna send out a psa saying hey this is a uh like one shade off i, I can't do anything about it uh uh order uh, or uh, don't. Had to had his gears of war pistol sitting here, and like had, had to like already had a hole in the design of the back of it, so I put two of those little magnets on each side, and drilled it out. Oh, nice! So I can actually. Hell yeah! Already got in the hips. Already got the uh, magnets in there. Name withheld. Uh, Kang is absolutely going to be back. Uh, I talked to my friend Sean. Uh, he works in the industry as well. Kang is absolutely going to be back in the um, in the MCU as well. He um, he's a producer. Uh, he was producing for Disney Plus. Uh, he has moved into Disney Plus and uh, into uh, working on the movies. He. Um, uh, he's not like a main producer, but he's one of the lower level producers. Um, he uh, he's he said that King is definitely back in. Like that's one of the reasons that that they never dumped him. Like when shit hit the fan, he said the first thing they would have done is dump him. Uh, but they learned their lesson from James Gunn not to just uh, knee jerk and get rid of him. Uh, they waited to see it out and see what happened. And when uh, the evidence came to light that he was innocent um, and there was video evidence that he was innocent, they said, okay, fuck it. You know, yeah, he's hard to work with. The man is an asshole, apparently. But, you know, he's a method actor and most of those guys are like pretty useful. Um so they're sticking with him so that's fucking rad uh he's awesome he's such a cool fucking actor so i'm super glad did i show you i got this guy man he's fucking cool i still got the 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 other one for you the, the black uh, lagoon yeah all right guys i'm gonna head on out i gotta no we, we, it's good we're getting close to the three hour mark i figure we get right we wrap up here soon I gotta, I gotta deal with my kid here to, so I gotta get out of here. But I appreciate the time as always. Thanks for letting me come in and chit chat and talk about Iron Man. <laughs> <laughs> I know how, I know how much I love that CT character. Yeah. But uh, yeah, uh, I'll I, see I, you guys I, on the next one. Probably uh, 
Sunday, right? Is the next go round? Yeah, Sunday will be the next go round. It's, it's our off week for the Thursday. Yeah, I might not make that one because uh, I have to work on Monday. Work. So it'd be like a thirty-minute stream. What do you want to do that for? Well, what's oh, money? Because everything costs money. Everything. Well, it's people not working out there has figured out somehow to do without it. So I haven't figured it out yet. Yeah, I ain't figured that shit out either. If I ever do, though, I'll let you know. I'll send you an email. Yeah. All right. Cool. Have a good night, guys. I appreciate it. You have a good night. Have a good night. Is that the uh, Jado? This? No, I'm giving. I'm giving you the Jada. Uh, it's a. It's the lighter color one, but it's the six inch. This is the Neca. Um, the okay. Neca has this like gold on it. Um, comes with three heads it has like the closed mouth a slightly open mouth and like a wider mouth like it's fucking wild it comes with six hands like two they're all mirrored it has like two like this two like this and two that are just regular splayed out i thought it had single jointed elbows because this is all you saw but it has a hidden one back here so it yeah. actually gets all the way so this thing, it, and, and then the crunch is actually pretty damn good. I mean, for something that has this much uh, rubber on it to be seamless, the mm -hmm. back not amazing because of all the fins, but the head has unbelievable like movement, just so good. A uh, pretty decent uh, um, back for uh like a swimming pose yeah so not 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 bad like not amazing but not bad um the legs though uh you would think they're gonna be restricted but neck goes all the way forward uh back about that much mm -hmm. out all the way spider-man eat your heart out and it's got it's ball jointed in there i had no problem with uh with any kind of stuck joints everything's got a little bit of uh, uh oil on it well, that's good and you got a little bit of thigh not a ton but a little bit enough it has you can see a peg hole right here which that's the only one which is super cool i thought it was going to be single but nope it has that same hidden joint in there so another hidden um joint right there uh as far as a uh, rocker goes back real far for a swimming position real far up and I mean, it has like the ankle rocker. I mean, like when they designed ankle rocker, uh, th this was this was it. Like this was it. <laughs> they said, Very yeah. cool. uh, So this thing is fantastic. Uh, all of my monster uh, figures are a lot of them are seven inch. So that this kind of works for me, whereas the Jada was six. It was a little small for Creature from the Black Lagoon for me. Yeah. Uh, I wanted him to be bigger. And that's one of the reasons why I'm, you know, I was, gonna, I was just going to give you that one. And, it, and that one is real prime for a wash and maybe a dry brush. Uh, um, so I think you'll have fun with that. Cool. Thank you, thank you. I gotta dig him out. Uh, get your box together. And get yeah, that I gotta stuff. get. I gotta get your stuff too. We got your figures. Yeah, me. I can't find collector's head at all. I have no idea where it went, but I'll just buy one or try to get one. Uh, what head? My friend. What head? The collector. The collector. The controller. I mean. The controller oh if you need a head i got one sitting right here oh yeah i do <laughs> yeah I, I i couldn't um 
I couldn't, I couldn't get it's I couldn't get one. I can't get one because it's it's just completely in my head. Look. I looked through everything I I had and it was it's no, it's gone. Yeah, I got an extra uh another Thor upstairs. Still in the box. Oh nice. I'm gonna use rough gold. The only thing I gotta need to do is get that Cersei out of the garage, put in your box, and that guy then I get wrecked up. No. I think that is time to wrap up the show anyway. We're three minutes till three hours, so we'll just go ahead and just call it night. On the live stream, everybody in the chat, thank you for coming out hanging out with us tonight. It's always a pleasure. Oh, yeah. I love getting the, if you answer any questions you got. But, uh, it was always fun getting to hang out with my buddies while we'll customizing. This Friday... Friday will be the uh, Collector Fusion with uh, Geek Fusion TV and myself I'm going over the toy news. Uh, pick it back for that one. Then we'll be back for on Sunday as for the uh, with its, uh, the next with the Sunday. So I'm going to do that one of YouTube stuff and like, share, comment, subscribe. We'll catch y'all next time. Later.